So here's how to cut out an image in Canva. It's very easy to do, but you will need Canva Pro. At least they come with a free trial, so I will leave a link down below in case you want to test that out, or you can simply use it to log in. Nevertheless, it's very easy to do. We're going to be using the Magic Eraser. So I have this image here, and what I want to do is simply click on it, and from there, go to Edit Image. From here, what you want to look for is the background remover. It might be a little bit lower in case you haven't, say, used it before. So if you're having trouble finding it, just go to like background, you know, start typing that in and it should come up. Nevertheless, let's click on it once. And what it's going to do is remove this background and let's see how good it does, especially with some of like the hair hanging here, see if it gets that. But let's check it out and see how it works. All right. And although it did remove some of the hair, I do think that's actually pretty good. What we can do is actually, if we wanted to change it a little bit more, we can go into like the erase here. And this is going to be the brush size. So if you kind of go over it, you can see how big it's going to be. So if we wanted to make this bigger, probably you wouldn't want to make it this big or any bigger if you're going to be doing like edges. But for like the fine tuned stuff, the smaller stuff, you can use it to kind of go in there and go around the edges. Like with this one, like I said, I'm curious to see how it's going to do the hair. Sometimes that is going to come up like that would be very tough to remove the background when the hairs are so thin. But I think it did a fantastic job here. And this is pretty much how it's going to work. When you are done, you can click on done there and then simply apply and just like that we have removed the background or excuse me we have cut out an image by removing the background that's basically how you can do it if you have any questions feel free to leave a comment down below my name is james thank you so much for watching and i will see you in my next video